Hey guys, how's it going? A lot of you have been messaging me recently on Instagram asking about how you can go about getting remote software engineering jobs. And I can see why so many of you are looking to go fully remote in 2022. A lot more companies are offering remote positions, video conferencing and collaboration tools have massively improved, you don't have to move out of where you live right now, and the compensation and benefits are equally good, if not better. But the issue is that it's not really easy to find positions that are fully remote. So today I wanted to show you how you can use Arc to start your remote development career. Arc has been a long-term sponsor of my channel and they've been making huge innovations in the remote software engineering job search space where companies apply to you instead of you applying to them. Arc will help you explore salaries, build your resume, and feature you to startups and tech companies that are looking to hire remote developers. The companies will then apply to you without any applications or recruiters in between. And you can receive multiple interview requests and fully remote permanent jobs at fast growing tech companies and high growth startups within just 14 days. Arc vets your technical skills and offers unbiased support to help you stand out. Their talent partners provide you with personalized support such as one-on-one -on -one profile reviews, interview preparation, salary negotiation, and global employment best practices. And by the way, ARC is completely free to join. It's super straightforward. Sign up and complete the vetting process. Once your profile is approved, it will be featured to companies directly for two whole weeks. You will start receiving interview requests, receive offers, and get hired. I think Arc is a great platform, but you don't have to take my word for it. Feel free to check out what other developers who have used the platform are saying. Okay, enough talking. Let me quickly show you the whole process so that you can get started right away. So before anything, you want to explore different salaries of the same tech stack that you use so you have a rough understanding of where you fall. The Salary Explorer is an interactive tool Arc built to compare remote software developer salaries based on each tech stack and location. So that way you can discover remote software developer salaries worldwide and see how you compare. And you can also refine the search by choosing the exact tech stack and location. Also you can find tips here to prepare for interviews and negotiate remote developer salaries as well. So once you have explored the salaries and are ready to get the process started, the first thing you need is a resume, obviously. So Arc has a resume builder. If you have a resume already, you can upload that and kind of improve it. If you don't have it, then you can start from scratch as well. Arc is generally designed for mid to senior level engineers. So if you have just graduated school or don't have a resume at all, this may not be for you, but you can still give it a try. But if you have any kind of experience or are senior level engineers, then this tool will definitely help you out refine your resume. Creating resume, just click on create resume. Let me upload my own resume here. See here. And it's going to scan, parse, fill out the data. Cool. Once you fill that, you can go to your next step, work history, which is going to completely fill everything out for you. You can go update this or do whatever you would like it to do. Then you go to skills, uh, node, and you get the idea, right? And then you can fill out the rest, you get the idea. But once you're done, when you go to the summary, it's going to ask you to write a few sentences of summary. And again, if you look at the tooltip over here, it's going to give you these tips and tricks to make sure your resume is good and it stands out. Um, let's just let's just copy paste something for now just to give you an idea. I'm not going to write a full summary here. And then if you hit preview, it creates an awesome resume for you, ready to go, fully formatted, nice. And you can use that for your applications going forward. That's how easy it is. Also, the resume builder is free to use, create and download, unlike any other tools out there. And it also formats your resume very cleanly. So it's ATS friendly and ensures that it's seen by recruiters. All right, so now that you've figured out where you stand in terms of salary based on your stack, location and experience, and you've built a really good resume to get started, now you want to apply to the process of getting vetted. So the reason you want to get vetted is because once your profile is approved, Arc will showcase your skills and profile to various companies that are looking to hire developers like you. Uh, and the hiring managers will directly contact you through Arc. This means you don't have to manually apply to jobs or get spammed with a bunch of outreach emails from various recruiters who may or may not understand exactly what you're looking for. 
And one more thing is like generally when you look at job application process, people just tend to go to the big names, popular names that everybody knows about. For example, you probably already heard of companies like Automatic and Spotify who actually work with Arc as well. But there are so many other great companies that you may not have known about, but through this process, you may have access to them or you may come to know about them and find them really interesting and a great cultural as well as technical match for you. So discovery is another thing that Arc really helps you out with. And the other really awesome thing that you get part of the vetting process is unbiased support to help you stand out, right? They have talent partners that provide you support such as your one-on-one -on -one profile reviews, interview preparation help, as well as salary negotiation so that you don't have to worry about all of those yourself. That's it, once you have filled out your profile, you kind of wait for their approval. Once you get approval, you should start seeing messages in your inbox from companies that want to hire you. And it's as simple as that. But that being said, you don't have to sit and wait around. You can go through their awesome list of amazing jobs and kind of look to see yourself if you find anything that you like. And then if your profile is approved, you can fast apply, which means that you don't have to go through the initial screening or anything like that. And you get straight to the hiring manager from there as well. Uh, ARC is available in North America, Central America, South America, and Europe right now, but they're opening in Asia as well as many other regions pretty soon. So yeah, go check out ARC if you're looking to start a remote software engineering career. Also, check out my interview prep playlist over here if you want some help preparing for technical design and behavioral interviews. I'll see you in the next one. Cheers. <laughs>